Hello everyone, my name is Tarek and welcome to Wiz Labs. In today's world, knowledge of working with database is a must. But with variety of databases in the market today, it has become challenging to keep up with the ever-changing technology. Wiz Labs AWS Certified Database Specialty Certification Bundle helps you to get advanced level knowledge of the multitude of the databases that are present in AWS Cloud. Now let's go to our platform which is wizlabs.com Go to Courses, Cloud Computing, Amazon AWS, and AWS Certified Database Specialty Certification. Prepare for the AWS Certified Database Specialty Exam and validate your knowledge of AWS database services and expertise of using database technology. As you can see that this course is already taken by almost 500 learners and has an overall rating of 4.5 stars. So let's check out the ratings. So you see all these rating and testimonials. These are from a certified learners. Pretty cool, right? Coming back to the course, here are some course highlights for you. This course comes with two full length mock exams that expose you to over 130 unique questions, a sectional test covering the most important topic of the exam, which is Amazon Aurora, AWS expert support to answer all your queries, and you get a lifetime access to this course once you purchase. If you're still in doubt, scroll down to our FAQ section that answers almost all your questions regarding the exam and the product, technical aspect of the exam, any general query about the certification, payment information, and if your query is still not answered, you can reach out to us using our support platform. Before you decide to buy this course, this Labs lets you take a practice test completely free of cost. Let me show you how. So you go to access now, and you would be asked to log in. So if you have an account, log in with it or sign up for one. You can also log in with your Google, Facebook or LinkedIn account. So let me sign in with my account and see you on the other side. All right, so before I proceed, I must tell you that you can access WizLabs platform across all Android and iOS devices. So you can learn on the go. Coming back, this is how the console looks once you're logged in. So the practice test tab is where you have all your practice tests. Here you see the two full length mock tests with 65 questions and a sectional test with 10 questions. These tests span and cover all the important topics for the certification. Now let's go to our free test by clicking this free button. You're taken to this screen that shows some exam details like the number of questions, time allotted, maximum marks, and the passing percentage. Down below are some exam instructions which I would recommend you to read before proceeding. And it also shows any of your previous attempts. So since I haven't taken any previous attempts, it, it's not showing anything, right? Now let's press the start quiz button and it will prompt you to start the quiz in practice mode. So I'll show you what starting the quiz in practice mode means by checking this button and starting the quiz. This is our test console. So you have your questions over here, your options down below. This grid of number actually lets you traverse through questions quickly. So suppose if you want to go to question eight, you can do it simply by clicking number eight. You would now normally have your timer running over here, but since we have started the quiz in practice mode, uh, there is no time limit. You see this show answer button. This is the feature you get when you start the quiz in practice mode. So if I click this button, you see it shows me the correct answer of this question. Although WizLabs provide you the correct answer of each question with detailed explanation at the end of the test, but with this feature, you don't actually have to wait for the test to end. Also, if you're confused about any question or are in doubt, and would want to come back to that question later, you can mark that question for review by clicking this mark for review button. And a red circle would appear around that question. That makes it easy for you to come back. Now let's do one thing. Let's answer a few questions and see our result summary. So let's quickly answer a few questions. Let's click click this review attempt and click submit to submit our test. So once you submit the test, you're taken to this report card page of yours. At the top is the concise report that tells you the number of attempts you've taken for this particular test, marks obtained in this test, your score, time taken, and your final result. Scroll down below and you have a domain wise breakup of the exam, which shows how many questions came from which domain, 
how many you got correct, how many you got incorrect and how many you just didn't attempt. Scroll below more and you have a detailed review of each question. This lab provides you the correct answer and detailed explanation for the same. Using this filter over here, you can choose what kind of question you would like to review. If there's an ambiguity related to any question or you are not satisfied with the answer, you can reach out to our AWS experts by clicking this Ask the Expert button over here. You need to select the type of query you have and provide the detailed explanation for the same and we will get back to you. You can also provide the feedback for any question using these emojis. So if you found that a particular question was actually helpful, you can select this happy emoji and tell us what you like. Similarly, if you didn't like the question or found it to be irrelevant or you had any other concern, select this sad emoji and tell us about it. Well, this was all about us and I hope we at Wiz Labs were able to clear all your doubt and answer all your queries and that you have decided to choose us as your learning partner. If so, sign up for an account and start your cloud computing journey with us. Wishing you all the best for your future. Thank you.